Senate committee will now hear from Jacob Lawson, Climate ISS Chief Coordinator. May the record reflect that he was nearly one hour late. Yeah, sorry about that. I literally had to fly in from outer space. Thanks to the system of satellites, natural disasters have become a thing of the past. We can control our weather. Mr. President, one of our thermospheric satellites malfunctioned over Afghanistan. So your proposal is what? We shut down all satellites. I don't need to remind all of you how many people died from catastrophic climate conditions. Make sure there's no further incidents. Are you going back up to space? I'm coming back. I promise. Have a safe trip, sir. Just don't touch anything. Main engine start. This is Mr. Jake Lawson. The Jake Lawson? You look much older than I would have thought. I, I mean, you, you look good. Am I getting fired? My access has been blocked. So satellite has a bad comm, that happens. Not a satellite, all of them. This wasn't a malfunction. It was intentional. There's potential for catastrophic weather events on a global scale. A geostorm. We have to shut the system down. The only one who has the kill codes is the president. I need your help. You're soliciting a secret service agent. Seriously? We're kidnapping the president in a self-driving cab. Jake, if you can't stop it, no one can. Oh, yeah, I kidnapped the president. I've stolen state secrets. Yeah, anything I'm forgetting, honey? Honey. Hold on! Marry her. So, what did you think of the video? Thumbs up or down? Well, stay with me as I have an interesting movie fact for you. Daniel Day-Lewis insisted upon growing his own facial hair for the role of Daniel Plainview in the movie There Will Be Blood threatening to quit the movie over the issue. Femi was uh, haltered for five days while he cultivated his facial hair. Now, if you haven't already done it, remember to subscribe and click the notification bell to always receive the latest trailers the moment they are online. Bye-bye.